Sometimes late at night, I lie awake and I watch her sleep. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I'm here again with another video, and today I will be basically exposing all my insecurities. So I will be telling you about all the insecurities I used to have growing up. If you are interested in the video, keep watching. My first insecurity would be the shape of my head. Growing up, I used to do a lot of um, freehand plaiting. I don't know, I think that's what you call it. Straight bags and all that kind of stuff. And I felt like my head was always exposed. And looking at myself in the mirror when I was younger, I always felt like I had like a flat head at the back and two little corners on the side. It was just weird and I really, really hated it. But um, as I grew up, I, I kind of like accepted my head and I found it normal. I, like... I tried a hairstyle recently, probably a year ago. I tried a hairstyle, a freehand hairstyle, and I looked okay in it. So I've basically just accepted my head and I like it just the way it is. I don't think it's that bad. Now I really don't think it's that bad. But before I hated it. So that was one of the insecurities I, I had. My other insecurity was my gap. Like, Nobody has ever told me that they didn't like my gap or it was ugly or anything like that. I just found it difficult to smile in pictures, um, showing my gap. I, I just didn't think it was cute at all. But I realized that that's what makes me me. How many people have that gap that I have? So I've just accepted it and I just embrace it. I still don't really smile in pictures showing my gap. But I think that's something I should start doing because I'm, I'm, I'm at a place where... I'm okay with it. So I've, I've embraced it and I like it now. So, yeah. The other security growing up was my eye bags. Like, I always felt like my face was so swollen. Um, I think I got it from my dad because he's got like eye bags under his eyes. I always had eye bags that I really hated. I hated it. I didn't know what to do about it. They were just there. But I think now they've started to go away. I don't really notice my eye bags as I used to in the past. So um, that's another thing. I really don't care anymore. I, another thing is like my ears. They're not that big. They're just kind of like like this. A little bit. So I've, I, I, always, I always tried to like hide them. Do like hairstyles that hide my ears so people don't see them. But now I don't care if I like a hairstyle and I want to do it and it's going to expose my ears. So what? My last and most annoying insecurity would be my uneven skin tone. I have such an even skin tone. I really don't know. I, I don't get it. Sometimes I really try to exfoliate. Sometimes I'm lazy. But I exfoliate either way. But I don't really see a big change. If any of you has a suggestion or a solution on how to deal with an even skin tone, Please let me know down below. So yeah, those are basically some of the insecurities I had growing up, if not all. Um, and I'm sure each and every one of you probably has their own insecurities, their own things that they don't like. But just remember something. You are beautiful just the way you are. Everything that you have is unique. There will always be somebody that is better than you, prettier than you, good looking than you, smarter than you. You just need to be the best version of who you are. That's the most important. Before I go, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. It will really help me out. Till next time, bye guys. Watch her sleep.